back to my channel. If you are new here, please go down and subscribe to my channel because I'm on the road and very close to 430. Big goal is 500, but we're going to do step by step. And I just want to apologise if you are new here and you've come across this video and I look like this. And I have one nail missing, need to sort that out after this video. But today's video, I'm not feeling that great in myself at the moment. Um, my skin is not the best either and I need to do some videos today so I thought I would do a really quick makeup video just testing out some of my latest products that I bought so I have got a Morphe palette uh, Anastasia Beverly Hills contour kit I got these from Depop so I'm going to test them out and I have actually got the Urban Decay All Nighter Long Lasting Makeup Setting Spray which Tara got me for my birthday and I cannot wait to try it so they are the three new items I'm going to try out for you today. So I just thought I would do my face products first and you've seen it a thousand times. So I'm going to just use a small primer, which I'm trying to use up. This is the Paul and Joe. I got it in some kind of subscription last year. So I'm going to try that out. The Revolution Conceal and Define Foundation. And I've also got the Collection Perfection Concealer. So I'm going to do these off camera because you've seen them a hundred times. Then I'm going to come back to do the contour kit. I can't do contour to save my life. So that's what it looks like. And I'm just going to have to go with the flow because I don't actually know what I'm doing. So I'm going to do these products first and then I'll be back with you. So that is the primer, concealer and foundation on. So now I think you do contour kit next before powder. I think I have actually no idea what I'm doing. So I think this brush is probably the best. And I'm going to go for the middle one because I don't think it's that dark. Right, now I'm going to go over with my face powder. I'm guessing that this shade here is a highlight. So I think that's a good palette. Um, I'm not quite sure what this yellow one is for. So if anyone does know, let me know. Well, these two actually, I don't have a clue. Um, but yeah, I think that is a nice palette, but I'm glad I didn't buy it second. Um, I'm glad I didn't buy it brand new because um, I do know this can be a really expensive product. So I'm just gonna comb my brows out first. And then I'm going to use the Soap and Glory pencil. I'm trying to use this up because the other end has actually dried out. And then I use the PS Pro eyebrow gel. I need to really pick up another one of these when the shop's open. The shop's actually open tomorrow, which is really exciting. So now it's onto the Morphe palette. Look at all them beautiful colours. Obviously, I think 
it's mostly for autumn but these are colors that i would wear all the time so let's just have a look at the glitter shades oh that one oh, i think they're beautiful especially for autumn halloween let's try i'm a sucker for the golds and bronzes right what should i go for I think definitely maybe this glitter, glittery one. Right, let's have a look. Uh, these obviously don't have different shades, but this is just the Morphe 350. So don't mind my very messy application because you can see here and here, I don't know actually what happens, but I think the payoff is really nice. So yeah, I'm really happy with that and I can't wait to do some of the golds and bronzes. I loved that. So I'm just going to do my mascara very quickly and comb it out and this is the Soap and Glory Thick and Fast. over and do the Urban Decay All Nighter and I cannot wait to try this. Oh there's two different lids, no idea why. Ready? Oh, it's very refreshing, cold, it doesn't smell bad. No it smells really nice so yeah I'm super glad I've got that. So while that is setting, I'm going to open this lip gloss if I can. There you go. And I have tried the Too Faced version. And obviously this is a lot cheaper. This was £4.99. This one is very, very glittery. The Too Faced is just clear. This one is very glittery. But it's not a bad thing. I do like it. So I've just finished my makeup. I think it looks really nice. Like I say, I have messed up a little bit with the eyeshadow, but I think the eyeshadow pigment is really, really good. Don't put too much on your brush because it will fall out under here, which happened to me. But I'm really excited to put these new products in my makeup drawers because when I get new products, I put them away ready for a testing video. But now I can put them in my makeup drawer. And I definitely think I need some more practice with the, more, um, the Anastasia Contour Kit. I need to learn a little bit of how to use all the colours. This I really love. And obviously, I'll just see what my makeup is like a little bit later to find out if it, was, if it is 16 hour wear or not. My lips are very, very tingly right now. But yeah, I need to go edit this video, upload it, because I aim to do two more videos. I need to do a summer clothes declutter and then an outfit video. And I could do the outfit video first, but I would like to see if there's anything in the summer stuff that I would like to wear for it. So yes, thank you guys for watching this video. Please like, comment and subscribe because it really does mean the world to me. And I'm going to really try and up my game um, starting this week I need to have all my videos uploaded edited and ready to go because I've been slacking a little bit and yeah I don't want to slack I really enjoy doing YouTube so I'll see you guys later bye